Damon Steyer. I paint signs at New Bohemia Signs in San Francisco. There's so much signage that's so complex and, and convoluted and methodologies are, are so multifarious, but like here at this sign shop, we're kind of focused on much more rudimentary aspects of signage, mainly the squiggles, the strokes, the curves, the individual parts of, that make up the alphabet. I mean, it's all reduced to just literally one color of this shape against another color. That's that's like where our focus is, where my interest is, and where what's kind of exciting all the, the others at the shop about the stuff is, yeah, just is how it flows, you know, directly from from your from your brain, from your whatever your creative engine to to your muscles, and that and your actual physical body determines the shape of of each of these these letters. I was going through a change of life. I had a marriage that ended, and I quit a job that I'd had for many years that I that I loathed, and uh, I decided to get myself into some kind of creative work ethic, where I was doing some sort of creative work every day. And so I went about looking for an apprenticeship. I, I walked into to New Bohemia Signs and was told, "Oh yeah, come come in tomorrow. I'll pay you seven dollars an hour." And it's like, oh, wow, that was. Great, because I wasn't expecting to get paid at all or anything. The man who was managing the shop at the time, Morris, said that I, I would come in and practice for a half hour on my own time, basically. So I'd come in and brush out letters, and he would coach me on that, and, and then I would help him with things like rolling out backgrounds and signs and, and such. Uh, then eventually he had to leave the shop and recommended me to the owners, who at the time were based in New Orleans, to, to take over management from him, uh, during which I basically continued to apprentice with them uh, by telephone. I would come in again every day on my own time and practice painting out alphabets or whatever letters I saw fit to paint or, or drawing, tracing things from books, uh, uh, you know, just learning the letter forms and letter spacing. And then I would take snapshots of that and then mail them the snapshots and then a couple days later hear back from them, feedback from the practices and what I should work on this week. And, uh, and then in the meantime, I was visiting clients and delivering bids and, and uh, painting. They would do, they would design signs and, and fax me. The, it's so amusing to me that all this is done by snail mail and fax, and it was only 10 years ago. And what, I, what I learned best was, was practice. I mean, that's the only way that the, the skill comes, the, the, the ability to, to, to turn an, an O or, or you know, brush out any kind of stroke quickly and cleanly and efficiently enough to, to make money as a sign painter just comes through practicing every day. And that's what they instilled in me then, and that's what I needed and what I was looking for when I started here. It's all about building up some kind of muscle memory. You're, you know, you, you just keep turning the O again and again until you, you don't even have to think about it. You don't have to like fret about, you know, what do I do now? It's just, it's all that stuff gets remembered in your hand and not in your fingers and your wrist. And that just happens through re repetition. With, with hand lettering, like the, the corners are kind of defined by the, the, the thickness of your brush and, and to some extent your skill, your deftness with, with, with the brushwork, but, uh, but they're never as sharp as, as you know, a, a vectorized computer printed image or whatever. The corners aren't sharp. Everything's kind of, it's, it's slightly loose. It's not perfect. And that's like I tried, uh, I was in a, a business networking group one time and, you know, I, Everyone had to give kind of a 30 second infomercial to, to entice the other members to, to uh, advertise their services for them. And, and, and I had this tagline that New Bohemia signs, our signs aren't perfect, they just look really good. It's, it didn't really work though. <laughs> Yeah, for an online near you. Oh, I thought so. Yeah.